guys i hope you are having such a good day today we are going to work on syllables but before we get started somebody has a birthday today does anybody think they know who it is it's somebody in the afternoon class he's a super cute guy mm, it's mccoy so mccoy i'm gonna sing happy birthday to you are you ready happy birthday to you happy birthday Day to you. Happy birthday, dear McCoy. Happy birthday to you. McCoy, I hope you have a very happy birthday and I hope you ride the four wheelers and I hope you get the cake that you want. So we're going to work on syllables today and we're going to work on one, two, three, or four syllable words. Remember, syllables are when we clap and say the word at the same time and then we count the claps. We can also chop them. Okay, so let's look. Here's our first one. What is that? That's a cookie. Let's put the cookie right here. Let's get our hands together and let's say cookie and clap cookie. Are you ready? Cookie. How many times did we clap? Two. That's exactly right. So we're going to put the cookie under the number two or below the number two. Let's get another one. What is that a picture of? Look where the arrow's pointing. It's your elbow. Can you see it now a little bit better? It's your elbow. I'm gonna slide these over and we're gonna put our picture right there. And let's chop it this time. Let's do elbow. One, two, three, elbow. How many syllables? Two, good job. So we're gonna put this with cookie below the number two. Let's get another one. What is that a picture of? Those are ants. Now, when we do syllables, it's really important to say the word regular. Are we going to go ants? Nope, we're just going to say ants. Let's put it right here. One, two, three, ants. How many times did we clap? Just one. So we're going to put it below the number one. And you know what? It doesn't fit very good, so I'm just going to turn it the other way and move it down one like that. All right, let's get another one. What is that right here? It is a pumpkin, but when a pumpkin has a face carved in it, does anybody know what it is? Jack-o-lantern. Let's put it right here. Let's do jack-o-lantern on the count of three and let's chop it. One, two, three. Jack-o-lantern. That's a tricky one. It has four. You are right. So let's put that right below the number four. Hey, let's keep going. How about this? Does anybody know what that is? We put things underneath it and it can make little tiny things look big enough for our eyes to see. It's called a microscope. Can you say microscope with me? Microscope. Let's do microscope. One, two, three. Microscope. How many did we have? We had three. So we're going to put this below the number three. Let's keep going. We have a few more down here. Oh, we know what this is. What is that? It's a key. Now remember, it's important to say things regular, so let's do key. One, two, three, key. How many did we have? We had two. Oh, not two, Mrs. Larson. Crazy key. We only had one. See, even Mrs. Larson makes mistakes, and it's okay. So I'm going to put that with ants below the number one. Hey, here's our next one. Ooh, does anybody know what this guy is? It's an alligator. Alligator. Let's put it over here and let's do alligator. Are you ready? One, two, three. Alligator. Does anybody know how many? Let's do it one more time. Alligator. It has four, just like jack-o'-lantern. Okay, we're gonna do just a few more. Does anybody know what this is? It's a raspberry, and raspberry is one of my favorite fruits. I love raspberry jam so much. Let's do raspberry, are you ready? Let's put it over here, let's do raspberry. And this time you can clap, you can chop, you can clap on your lap, whatever you wanna do. I'm gonna chop, let's do raspberry. One, two, three. Raspberry. How many? Three. Good job. We're going to put 
raspberry below that microscope, below the number three. What is this? It's a basketball. Let's do basketball. And you can choose to do it however you want. You can clap, you can slap on your knees, you can slap on the carpet, you can chop. Let's do basketball. Are you ready? One, two, three. Basketball. How many? Three. Let's put it below the number three. Last one, you guys. Last one. What is that right here? One of my favorite vegetables to eat with butter on it. It's corn. Now remember, say it regular. Let's do corn. Are you ready? One, two, three. Corn. How many did we have? We had three. So I'm going to put this below the number one. Now let's see which group had the most. Number one has one, two, three. Number two has one, two. Number three has one, two, three. And number four has one, two. Which group had the most? Hmm. You are right. The number one and the number three both had the most because they are the same and they both had three. I miss you guys so, so much. And I hope you guys are doing your homework and I hope you are doing everything that your mom and dad are asking you to do. And I will see you guys again tomorrow. Bye-bye.